Hey YouTube, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers, life, and tech. And for this episode, we're going to talk about this sample pair of the Adidas Ultra Boost Game of Thrones sneakers. Now, if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please make sure that you do so because we are doing a bunch of giveaways right now. We're giving away a new era Street Fighter cap. We're giving away Supreme accessories. Uh, yeah, and, uh, and just a bunch load of stuff. All you have to do is to subscribe to the channel, follow me on Instagram, hit the notification bell, and then hit the link down below for the rest of the mechanic. If you are wondering why I'm wearing a cap, it's because I just woke up. My hair is a total mess. My voice is still a bit weird. And yeah, I, this is what I do. I usually shoot the videos every morning, either when I wake up or late in the evening because I do have a full-time job. Uh, I do have a run a few businesses on the side, so I just try to squeeze in time to be able to shoot and create the videos for you on a daily basis. So forgive the voice, forgive the cap. At least you don't have to, you know, bear with my hair. So <laughs> let's go. I'll start with a disclaimer. I have no idea if this is 100% legit or if it is 100% real and authentic. My main reason for that is because the guy who I got it from basically said that it was just a sample pair that he was able to get from Hong Kong. Now, having said that, you can't really say if it's 100% legit. I think the best you can do is like say with like 80 to 90% confidence that it is real. And I personally can't even get to that point. But having said that, it does look very similar to the official images of the photos that came out of this sneaker online from Adidas. It has that same color. It has the same materials. The prime net is pretty good. The boost is pretty believable. So having said all of that, uh, I, I, I'm still not 100% convinced that it is real, but at least we have a good peg. And that's what we're going to do today. We're going to talk about what we can expect with the Ultra Boost uh, Game of Thrones House of Targaryen sneakers. Let's get to it. There are three things that I love about this sneaker. Number one is the colorway. When it comes to the colorway, I just love the contrast of that orange fire effect that you guys have here at the forefoot and the midfoot. Then it becomes a gradient black here at the back of the sneaker. And then of course, you have the black boost and the black continental outsole. It just really looks so kick-ass. It looks like it's like kind of some sort of like a dragon fire, which is pretty much the theme of House of Targaryen, right? Uh, so that's one of the things that I love about it. It's definitely going to pop. It's definitely going to break some necks and turn some heads. The second thing I love is the difference in materials because usually when you take a look at the cage, they are made from some sort of plastic material or some sort of well, not so nice material. Now they actually used leather. So you have leather along both sides of the sneaker for the cage. And then they also put leather here at the, I don't know if it's like some sort of marking of the tongue tab. So you have like Adidas, the Adidas logo here at the front embossed in, or etched in some sort of brown leather. Again, very reminiscent of the era of Game of Thrones. Very and lastly, I love the detailing for which reminds me a lot of Game of Thrones. You have a tag here at the back that says fire and blood so i don't know if you guys can see it but there you have it it says there fire and blood and then inside the shoe there is the house logo of house targaryen which is the three-headed dragon one more thing that i love is the black on black effect of the word ultra boost here on the heel part of the sneaker it just looks kick ass looks pretty cool so those three things, the colorway and the color blocking, the quality of the materials that are used, especially the leather cage, and the small details of Game of Thrones, for me, makes it a really fantastic sneaker that maybe every Game of Thrones, or at least die-hard Game of Thrones fans, would probably want to get and, you know, add into their collection. Now, how is it on feet? Now, it is an Ultra Boost, so you get the Prime Knit experience, you get the Boost experience. It is going to be one of the most comfortable sneakers that you guys will wear. So there's nothing really much to be said about how good the Ultra Boost silhouette is and how great it is when it comes to all-around comfort and versatility. So having said that, uh, that much I can say that it, it will be one of the best experiences that you can give your feet. Now, personally, this isn't my size. I, I still am able to fit my feet in them, but it's not the best fit, as you guys will see. 
Uh, but at the end of the day, it, it's really a great sneaker. The Ultra Boost is a fantastic sneaker. And the great news is that we're not seeing anymore a shortage of the Ultra Boost silhouette. In fact, if you go to an Adidas store in the Philippines, you'll see a lot of them just sitting on shelves. So there used to be a time where Ultra Boost would just fly out of shelves even if it's a general release, making it hard for people who just want to rock the shoe and buy the shoe uh, to be able to get them for retail. You'll have to pay like a, pay like a premium price because resellers will just buy all of them. So it's great that Adidas is finally making it more available, making it more like uh, accessible, even when now that they're doing like the retros of the V1s and they're doing more partnerships like this one with Game of Thrones. Now, this sneaker will be coming out, I think, in January or February next year. There were sightings of it already in Japan, uh, this as early as December. So I really wouldn't be surprised to see this hit our shelves or our shores in just a matter of months, guys. So if you are a Game of Thrones fans, just hold on to your seat. Wait for the official release. Oh yeah, that's what I really want to say. Wait for the official release. I cannot say with certainty or 100% confidence that this sample pair that I have with me is legit. It's real. Uh, I paid the premium for it. I paid the hefty price for it. Uh, looking back, it's probably something that I wouldn't do again, but I really just want to get like a quick comparison of this particular sneaker with the images that we've been seeing online to get some sort of feel or vibe for what we can expect when it finally drops. So again, guys, if you are a fan, if you want this sneaker, let me repeat that. Wait for the official release. Wait for it to hit the shelves here in Adidas, Commonwealth, or Soul Academy, or whatever store will be the one to carry the shoe. And don't risk buying sample pairs because, you, again, you never really know if it is 100% real. Because, hey... I've been into this sneaker thing for a few months now and I still really can't tell if this is really real or not. But that's it for now, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please do hit that notification bell, follow me on Instagram, subscribe to the channel so you can be part of the giveaways that we do regularly on this you know, channel. So hit the link down below as well for the mechanics of our latest giveaway. That's it for now. I hope you're all having a great weekend. Peace, God bless. What's up? Boom.